It is a Whiteboard Wednesday, March 1st. Where did January and February go? Raise your hand if you're like me, and this year has been the toughest year you've had in a long time. And it's only March 1st. A lot of times a question comes up of how much money that I make. Some of you may be watching wondering yourself, how do I make more money in this type of economy? Got my nine to five job, check. What can I do on the side? So a lot of times I'll get the question, I need to make more money, how do I do it? If you are the type of person that you are in a place where you're gonna commit to doing something on the side to generate extra revenue where it's no longer a hobby, it is now a bona fide attempting to make an earnings with my side hustle, then this Whiteboard Wednesday is for you. Everything that I'm about to share is from the book 212 leadership or is that 212 leadership or is it 212 leadership 212 that's on the book cover this is from that book written by Mac Anderson he describes a one page strategic plan and here is the one page strategic plan number one vision where is your side hustle going? What do you see when you close your eyes and you look at that beautiful blue sky? What do you see? That is your vision. Write that vision down. Number two, mission. What is the mission of your side hustle? The mission is the driving purpose of your business. The why behind your vision. Well, I would like to do this, Troy, and the reason is, that's your mission. Number three, values. The values is kind of that guide that ensures you're doing the right thing. The guide you use for decision making in how you treat others. Values. Number four, objectives are the numbers that you track. A lot of times after someone starts their side hustle, they're starting to realize that, oh, this is harder than I thought it would be. Troy, it isn't working. Well, why isn't it working? How many dials have you made? How many networking events have you attended? If that answer is zero, then most likely it's really hard to generate some kind of money for your side hustle. You've got to set your objectives and they don't have to be enormous. Oh, I need to go to a networking event once a week. No, maybe it's once a month. Meet one person, get to know them, cultivate that relationship, set those objectives, don't be scared of them, and then that will help hold you accountable. See previous Whiteboard Wednesdays for accountability. Number five, strategies. Why I like the fact that there's an S here and not just strategy is because when you are doing your side hustle and you've set the objectives because of the why and the values of how you're going to treat others and you've set your objectives of what needs to be accomplished, the strategies are the many paths to get to your objectives. I live in Las Vegas, very different from Seattle. Living in Seattle, uh, one, maybe two ways to get from A to B. Las Vegas is flat in a desert, in a valley. Oh my goodness, I have five or six options on how to get to the same place. That's what these strategies are. You might be coming up, going down a road, you thought you would be going, there's a big detour sign. So you gotta go take a little right, and then take a left, and then a right again to get around, but you'll still get to your objective. Finally, number six is priorities, in which Mr. Anderson describes it as the work that needs to get done and the individual that needs to do it. A lot of times in a side hustle, you've got people that are close to you, friends, family members, that are doing work for you. They're not charging you, they just wanna see you succeed. Having the right priorities is what will help you get the path to the objectives. Now, priorities in this context are really just tasks. So you found the path, you're gonna put down tasks to do. I really believe that priority is not multiple. There's one priority. When you start getting into priorities, you're adding undue pressure when it's just one priority, baby. One priority at a time. I hope this helps. This is nothing compared to what you can get by reading 212 Leadership from Mac Anderson. My name is Troy Ritchie. If you don't know me, you will. Oh, 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 oh,